Hi guys, this is JT Gravity RC. Welcome back to my channel. Um, in this video, I'm going to talk about um, this GPS enable quad, and um, it hasn't come out yet, but it's on alert on uh, Banggood, and I think that this is the this is going to be the cheapest GPS enable quad on the market, and um, it has many features of some of the bigger quads. Um, so I think this one is looks very promising and um, I'm looking forward to this quad so initially I was thinking maybe the Hubson X4 H502E is a good GPS quad but I've seen a lot of videos it doesn't seem to be a good GPS enable quad and also this is a brush models and if you look at the price this is 89.59 US dollars and the CG035 brushless is 117.99 so you pay about $27 more you get a GPS brushless enable quad with headless mode and um, it probably has return to home function and let's scroll down and this is double the size of the Hubsung X4 and it, although it doesn't come with a camera holder but you can easily get one of those uh, cheap ones to around four, four to five dollars which I will put a link in the description later so this is brushless it has a control distance of 300 meters and the battery is 2 cells 2600 milliamps and it has a flying time of 15 to 20 minutes that's a long time and it has headless mode one key return and you can adjust the transmitter between mode 1 and mode 2 so this looks very very promising and uh, definitely you should get this one as a trainer camera quad and also GPS quad um, I don't need to really buy one to show you how it's going to perform because there is already a video up on this page which you can click and also, I'm, I'm suspecting that this will perform like all the entry-level brushless camera quad like for example, uh, the Valiant Toys X16 well, that one doesn't have GPS but I think it performs similar in flight but because this is a bit smaller than Valiant Toys X16 so it's not that heavy so it's going to be a lot easier to fly so you can also look at other camera quads with GPS enabled so I think this one has a similar flying characteristic of those type of quads so as long as you don't expect DJI Phantom type of performance and features I think this is a reasonable quad uh, with a reasonable camera quad and uh, provided it's promising I think this is going to be the cheapest brushless GPS enable quad on the market and if it performs like all the other ones entry level camera quad which is those below the, the quality and features of the G DJI Phantom and this should be a fantastic quad so I'm predicting that this is going to be the cheapest brushless quad on the market and don't get this Hubsung X4H502E it has brushless models and the sun doesn't perform that well and it's, it's just terrible but with this one I think you are going to like it I may be getting one myself also um, see how it goes 
but um, yeah looking at this I'm pretty sure that you're going to like this quad and it's going to be formed very easily so let me make this a bit bigger for you to have a look and scroll through the pictures and it looks very nice and if you like it just go and put in an alert, an alert me on, on arrival and then you get alerted and you can go and buy it so I, I hope um, you like this video and uh, if I'm uh, and I hope that you like and subscribe to my channel and until next time this is JT Gravity RC cheers